Hi everyone, I am going to be doing another plan with me week in my Erin Condren, my horizontal planner. I'm going to be using it um, to commemorate the uh, last uh, week of school for the Jelly Beans, Maddie, Matt, and Jeff. i am also got my birthday week in there, so I've got two weeks to go through. The kit that I'm using for the uh, No More School is actually this one from Villa Beautiful. It's called Dream Big. I thought it was good for the last week of school, so I hope that you stick around and join me. Hi everyone, I'm Nancy and welcome back to my channel. I am as always, I am so excited to see you. I love sharing these videos with you. They are really helping me stay motivated. They're, you're helping me make some memories that I hope to look back on later on and just uh, look at the memories that are in this book and just uh, bring a smile to my face. So I just wanted to say thank you again. I hope if you are new to this channel, you click on that little red subscribe button over there. I'd love to have you come back and join me for future videos. I hope everyone gives this video a thumbs up. And before we get started, I thought everyone might want to know, what the heck is Nancy going to drink today? Well, you know, I was going to have a cappuccino coffee and caramel macchiato coffee, but it's so hot and humid, as you can tell from my frizzy hair. But anyway, so I am going to be making a pomegranate twist martini. And this is uh, Rose's Cocktail Infusions. You're supposed to just use one part of this to one part vodka, but that's a little uh, strong for me. So I'm using two parts of the pomegranate twist and one part vodka. So I got it in my little mixer here. I'm using this glass that was actually my mom's. It's got these uh, desert roses on it. Francisco or I don't know, something like that. So anyway, let's mix this up. Pour it in. Actually, the picture behind me with the girl on the bike is actually from my mom's house as well. She bought it at a yard sale and she never um, hung it up and then uh, we took it we took it after she passed and I just recently hung it up a few weeks ago it's been just kind of sitting on my floor in my bedroom just like it did at her house but anyway so pomegranate twist martini I hope that you uh, just stick with me and join me and we will chat again soon everyone Alrighty, so this is the first week here. So this is actually my birthday week. It is from Monday, June 8th through Monday, June 14th. I'm using this kit from the Planner Co. Company. Just an awesome, awesome kit. It's called the Birthday Girl. So I thought that was perfect for this week. I've got some new stickers in here from a company I haven't used before, like this Coffee Because Monday Happens, the Happy Hour sticker. Um, so anyway, I'm, I'm not going to do go through day by day because I've got two weeks to do, but I'll just kind of hold it up and go a little closer so that you can see how the a week progressed. And I will probably put this on with some music in the back.
Alrighty, so I am on take number 15 or 16. And I am just having such trouble with this one this week. I've been trying to read the letter that uh, Jeff got from the president, and I just keep tearing up. So, And then I finally did it, and then fireworks went off in the backyard, and Mr. Griffin's here, and he went spastic. So now I made it through without crying, but now I've got to do it from the fireworks. So anyway starting the week on Monday here. So we've got Jeff here. They actually had a little ceremony at his school and just so proud of our grandson Jeff here. So the kids got to go with their face mask and uh, grab their diploma. They all got to pose uh, one by one in front of the school with a sign that said congratulations class of 2020 so the parents could take a picture. And here we have the presidential award for the education award. So it reads um, congratulations to the recipients of the 2020 President's Education Award. Over the past year, the individuals who have earned this distinguished honor have exhibited exceptional work ethic and determination. Our nation will soon look towards these future leaders for guidance, and I am confident that they will continue to build a stronger and more prosperous future for our great country. The First Lady joins me in applauding the educators, administrators, parents, and other community leaders who have been there every step of the way to encourage and uplift these bright young men and women. As these talented students pursue their dreams and practices, we send our best wishes for continued success. Keep up the great work. I'm just so proud of you, Jeffrey Duff. So anyway, just uh, really, really really special that he uh, got that award so anyway though i am proud of all of our grandchildren they are all exceptional so monday i had to call back uh true uh true green they um i've got a lawn service through them and they do the uh, mosquito control and i think they had come on thursday and saturday and sunday you couldn't even walk outside. The mosquitoes were so, so bad. So I ended up on uh, Monday calling customer service to complain, and they said that they would send somebody out. I really had my doubts, but you'll see later that they did come. Uh, we had a Dunkin' Donuts finally show up in, uh, in my neighborhood, so I was so, so excited about that. And um, I know it's been really, really busy because it's new. So after work, I went and there wasn't a line, so I went through the drive through so I got my Dunkin's. Uh, sign right there. I, ha I asked for an, ex an iced coffee, um, the caramel swirl, extra, extra, and nobody knew what I was talking about because even though they're from New England, no one told them what extra, extra meant, so I had to explain it to them. So anyway, so excited to have my Dunkin' Donuts back. I worked on YouTube for about three hours. I had happy mail when I came home. I had uh, got some mail, some stickers from the planning the giving girl so anyway just really love that really was um, excited to open that up and of course because it's Monday I've got my coffee girl on to Tuesday so Tuesday I needed to um, update my auto deliveries for both isogenics and it works a lot of times it doesn't change but I do change like the it works sometimes I'll get the chocolate greens or sometimes I get the keto coffee or sometimes I need the just celery so I do change that quite a bit the isogenics is probably pretty much always the French vanilla but every now and then where they have a different flavor come out I just want to check to make sure that's not available so got that done I worked on YouTube for about four hours I did my Pilates reformer for about 20 minutes I went to Target after work and I needed a few things like coffee cream is so important to me and OJ because you know on the weekends I discovered that I like to have a little bit of orange juice in the morning to get some vitamin C but I can't drink orange juice by itself so I have to put in a little like whipped cream vodka or vanilla vodka and it's awesome 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 on to Wednesday so here we've got our granddaughter Tori Pie she's given us a thumbs up for no more school um, I went to Duncan's again after work for some iced coffee it was trash day um, I also changed my wax and my warmers um, I got my Transcend in, so I filmed, edited, and got the uh, Transcend try-on unboxing uploaded, so happy about that. On to Thursday. So Thursday, True Green actually did come back, and um, Lon did a, did a great job. Um, I actually, when I came home and I saw it in front of my yard, and then I saw it because I put a little thing there that they sprayed Yulon, and then 
I noticed my neighbors on either side of me had their uh, sign out too. So I went and chit chatted with them and they said, yeah, they ended up calling on Monday because the mosquitoes were so bad. So they came back and did like four of us in a row. So don't know if the mixture they used that um, the week before was bad or maybe they just didn't use enough. But anyway, the four of us all got done. So we are excited about that. I also ordered my Jaws 4K, so I'm so excited about that. Um, you see that in another video and why it's so important to me. Um, I got my YouTube. I worked on YouTube for about four hours. And on to Friday. So we've got our grandson Aiden here, and his teacher actually bought all her students uh, a virtual graduated um, from their school with their grade on it. And it was just so exciting for her. He, he's so proud of that shirt. And it's just so nice and you know i feel bad that a lot of the teachers do go out of their way and use their own money to buy supplies and fun things like that for the kids so just uh, it's just a really nice memory for the kids to have that so anyway at work we had a pizza and then after work we had some cocktails i went to duncan's after work for some iced coffee this is going to be in my undoing um because anyway even if i don't uh, go to duncan's after work then on the days that i don't go because i work too late and they close at eight o'clock um you know, you know i'll come home and make my own and i use a lot of cream um so it's friday i got my friday sticker i've got the wine girl to signify that we had cocktails i worked on youtube for about six hours and i walked on the treadmill for about two miles on to saturday i know that uh, tim had a busy week um we're doing some things for his mom and things so i had one of the other neighbors take the uh lawnmower out of the shed for me so i did my lawn and his lawn i also weed whacked my hill uh i got the uh my erin condor and my seasonal box had come in so i was able to get that filmed and got that uploaded i had some uh planner company planner co was having a sale on etsy so i actually put in a uh, sticker order for that so i'm excited about that um i did laundry so i got my sheets done and a load of darks and i've got this little gem here to signify that i was putting in my last touchstone crystal order with belinda conti so sad about that um i worked on youtube for about five hours and i've got my coffee girl here because on the weekends i love to sit and relax and just have a nice big big cup of coffee uh, same on Sunday. I've got my coffee girl to signify that. We've got our grandson, Matty Matt here. He's actually made that little uh, figurine there with the wax from the Baby Bell wrappers. I love Baby Bell too. Uh, and I, then I added the schools out. So I had to check out, decide what I wanted to keep from my Transcend box early this week and got my returns ready to go back. I worked on YouTube for about three hours and I worked on my one of my film and I edited and uploaded a plan with me. So I've got my planning session and I picked out this little one cause it's got a bike and it's not the right kind of bike, but um, Maddie Matt used to be big into racing bikes and dirt bikes and things like that. So he's got a room that's just full of his trophies. And um, you know, then actually he's, he just started to get out of it as he got older and it used to be fun the people around him that were even his age and a little bit older just started to get too competitive and just uh, would go out of their way when they knew that the camera wasn't on them or they had a blind curve that they would actually go after and uh, knock the other kids off their bikes and things like that. So we had some friends that were getting pretty banged up and he said, you know, this isn't fun anymore if I've got to worry about this. So he actually gave that up. So, but um, he was an awesome, awesome rider. So I hope he still goes out and does it for fun, but not competitively anymore. So anyway, on to my final stats. So I've got this Alice Cooper, because everybody knows school's out for summer, but we've got schools out for Corona. I've got my elliptical steps here. Um, so I did 80,900 steps. I had pedaled for 21.46 hours. Um, my miles were 32.36. My Fitbit steps were 52,190. I started the week at 111.2. And thanks to Duncan's opening up, I finished the week at 112.6. So anyway, that is everything in my plan with me week so this ended up being a little bit longer than I wanted so I want to thank everyone for joining me and we will chat again soon bye bye